Well, it started and ended all within a week. A CVS policy carding customers purchasing nail polish remover with acetone, a full measure believed to prevent the production of meth. But even though the policy didn't last long at CVS, KX8 News reporter Monica Castro shows us how other stores are looking at ways to stay proactive in fighting against drug production. When you think of being photo ID'd, you don't associate it with purchasing nail polish remover with acetone. But for a short time, CVS Pharmacy did just that. Candace Nelson doesn't think it's fair, but... I, I understand the need for it. You know, um, I know a lot of stores make you show your ID for spray paint and Sudafed over a certain amount. Nail polish remover with acetone contains a chemical component used in the illegal production of methamphetamine. Chemicals used or the items used in making meth are things that you would find in your household and there are things that are readily available everywhere. While CVS doesn't ID anymore, could other stores around town card for such products? If it's something that uh, the community has determined there's a problem with that we it would help uh, for say an ingredient to you know that's been used is wrong, we'll either we could either put it behind the counter or come up with that carding process. It's been done before. We've taken items off the shelf before, like uh, baby formula, powdered formula was being used in an illegal way. So we pulled that off the shelf and put it where it wasn't accessible except for through the courtesy booth. And it's pretty simple to enact such a policy. We'll go through our human resource department come up with a uh, instruction sheets for all our cashiers to read and sign so they're aware of it. And for many, it's not the policy itself, but the reason behind the policy that doesn't sit well. It's really sad that you can't just go out and buy Sharpies or buy spray paint and not be carded. These kinds of restrictions and inconvenience for some, but a measure some stores may take to prevent drug production. Monica Castro, KAGS HD News. Village Foods does not card on acetone nail polish, nor will they right now, but will consider any request from law enforcement.